assalamu alaikum this is mohammed ramiz and you are watching clutter galaxy so in this video we are going to cover about how we can upload image locally okay and show it into the screen so right now you, uh, you can see that i have already attached my upload uh, upload action which is store and upload um, store media for upload and you need to make sure that the name would be always unique across your application okay otherwise it will throw an error so after uploading the after store media for upload uh, action uh, what you need to do you need to wrap the action with your image by uh, by doing uploaded files so right now my behavior of my mm, image is uh, upload file and here i have attached uploaded file mm, local file which is coming from widget state okay so you need to click here and you need to connect this thing and after connecting these things if i reload my uh, application so you will be able to see that like this you will be able to see this kind of screen uh, again so yeah you can see that it's now loaded and it's throwing like an exception message because right now we don't have any bytes but if i click here and i select gallery and i select an image so it will show an image uh, into the uh, console uh, into the sorry into the mobile application but here is a question in uh, which is in my mind um, if we don't have any uploaded uh, uh, if we don't have any uploaded uh, image so how can we eradicate that kind of error so in that way uh, maybe we can use uh, an other image uh, let's suppose what i'm gonna do um there are two kind, there are multiple kind of scenarios which we can achieve to build this kind of thing uh, so that when the image wouldn't be uploaded so it will show another image uh, maybe that image will say upload new file and uh, then the the other one would be showing uh, otherwise it will be showing the uh, exact image so we have already covered and uh, previously we have covered a widget which is known as conditional builder so maybe we can use that widget so if i'm gonna wrap this widget uh, into a conditional builder and now i i can show another image or any other widget into the else part so i'm gonna show the image directly here so i'm gonna say image why i'm doing this thing because in this uh, this time i want to show my network image and from the network image i want to show uh, the upload file image like this so i want to show that this kind of thing copy image address and then i'm gonna paste it and it will show like this so drop an image and once okay so this is an else part and the condition we are gonna set is that if the local file is set then you need to show this image other otherwise upload image so i'm gonna say widget state local upload file and copy this thing because we don't want to co uh, add this thing we want to add like a check so confirm and local file is a set if the local file is set then you need to show this local file image otherwise you need to show this image now the only problem we had is that uh, what if uh, because we have added our action into the uploaded file on on the uploaded file which is this okay so we need to cut this uploaded file action which is this and we need to cut this action because this action would wouldn't be appear uh, when the file is not uploaded so it will only appear when the file is uploaded okay so go to the else part go to the image section and if you can't see so you can enable this thing so now click on image and paste it here now uh, let's see if we if we move forward with the errors or not so if not so what you need to do you simply click on it and let's see what do we have so okay so we need to set this again and here we can say that local file upload is set and then the second property image local where we can also add uploaded file okay now let's reload the screen and test it out the application again be able to see that upload and drop file when i click here and select image 
and now I click here so you can see that the image is now uploaded there so that kind of thing I want now you can re review the image as well so this is the behavior that we want basically so this is the conditionality so that's how you can upload local image into your uh, filter flow application and you can also uh, also add the uh, checks upon the image so if you if you are not using your local image let's suppose if you are using your database image firebase image so in this way you also need to add a checks because in the firebase image you are not using a local uploaded file you are using network network okay so in the network you can either pick a url which is uh, which you can put on the else part and the 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 exact or actual url which is coming from the firebase you can add it into the if part okay so when the image is uploaded so you can show the firebase in url otherwise you can show the uh, the url which is showing that upload image okay so that kind of thing you can also achieve using flutterflow so i just thought to share you because uh, this is a really important thing uh, many, many times we only need to show locally image so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you into the next video